Hey, what's going on guys? So, I'm back. Just gonna be a real quick video. To, uh, gonna be kind of like the Rat Fitness bench videos. It's just a quick review on the new Titan Fitness loadable 20 inch Olympic dumbbell handles. So, it's not really new, but it's new to me. I actually just got these dumbbells in on the day before New Year's Eve, so on the 30th. Uh, they were on back order for around three months, but I just got them in and I, I gotta say, I don't like them at all. Uh, for one, I, maybe it was my own fault. I didn't really measure out how long 20 inches was, but the dumbbell is very long. So when I do any kind of, you know, bench motion, overhead uh, press motion, or even curling, the bars, the end of the bars, they would touch each other. But before I go into all the nooks and crannies about why I do not like the bar, uh, I'm just gonna go into some quick details about the bar itself. So, the bar itself, I'm gonna put most of the information on the screen, so if you guys want to know about the specifics and the exact details, you can just pause the video right here, and it'll have all the information on the screenshot of the loadable dumbbell on Titan's site. First things first, the grip on these dumbbells are amazing. I love the knurled grip. They are not the most aggressive knurled, but they do feel very, very, uh, I guess you can say grippy <laughs> on your hands. They are definitely not as aggressive as my Ohio Power Bar, but they do imitate a basically what a dumbbell would. Um, if you guys want a dumbed down, uh, dumbed down idea of what this dumbbell is, it's basically a barbell that shrunk down for your hands. Unfortunately, I'm not Brian Shaw, so I, these things don't fit in my hands very well. The upside for these dumbbells are the fact that you're, they're loadable, so you can use any of the weights that you already have at home for your dumbbells. Uh, so you can, you can put on a 10, you can put on a, a 5, if you're you know, a mongrel and you're Larry Wheels, you can put on a 45 and you can you know curl with those. I'm not crazy. I actually haven't even put on any weights for these. I'm just gonna sell them, put them, put them directly on the marketplace because I don't want them anymore. Titan did an amazing job when it comes to packaging. I know back in the day, even for when I got my deadlift jack from Titan Fitness, the box came and it was all kind of jacked up. It was there was holes in it, but I think they've been working on their packaging for sure because these things came in beautifully. They came in their own, uh, basically the tubes that you would have for a barbell. Uh, there was obviously, there was, no, there was no additional packaging or anything. It was straight in the sleeve. There was maybe a plastic film around it just to help with the scratches and everything like that. But even the box that it came in, no scratches, no dents. I know there's a lot of issues going on with that right now, but I guess I got really lucky with this packaging and it was perfectly fine on my end. These dumbbells are basically practically brand new. Uh, Rep sells them on their site for $74 and some change. I believe the last time I checked was yesterday we're on back order for two months out. But now I just checked today and they're actually just sold out. So they're not even on back order anymore. Uh, personally, I do not enjoy these dumbbells all that much. Uh, but if I can definitely see people using this for heavy dumbbell lunges, which I was able to do just today, and they work, per they work perfectly fine. I can also see maybe people doing rows with them, heavy rows. If you are going up to around like a plate on rows, I can definitely maybe see you using that. The range of motion is definitely not there, but you know, if you're a bigger guy and you know, it, you're used to having the weights farther out from you anyways, you should be fine. But somebody as small as I am, I'm not, I'm not the strongest person. I don't really want to be benching with my elbows flared out all the way like this just to make sure that the, the two tops don't touch each other. I don't know what else I have to say about this. That's kind of it, that was... Mm. But that's basically it. Um, overall, maybe like it's, it's a good concept. They definitely have a, I think they have a 14, 14 inch one and a 16 inch one. So this is the 20 inch one, I believe. This is the longest one they have, so you can load the most weights on there. Uh, if you want to get a shorter one, I'm thinking about maybe going to get that 14 inch one. It's only $50. So once that comes, uh, gets restocked, I was thinking about getting that or the, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, the 
The Nobel dumbbells were the adjustable ones. I think they're like $700 for the pair. I'll think about getting those as well. But whatever I decide to get, I'll give a review on it and hopefully give a little insight before you guys end up spending your money and waiting three months to get your product. But anyways, it's gonna be a short video today, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day and stay safe.